Hello, I'm Mark Fagan from Winston Solicitors. Today I'm going to discuss terminating a short shorthold tenancy. Two ways of going about this, Section 21 procedure or the Section 8 procedure. The Section 21 can only be used after the expiry of the fixed term. While the notice can be served during the fixed term, it cannot actually end until act after the fixed term of the tenancy. A notice needs to be given giving two months notice to the tenant. Once the notice expires, if the tenant remains in the property, possession proceedings can then be issued. These are known as accelerated possession proceedings. Now this is all a paper exercise and the judge decides ultimately based on what's in the claim form. This is a simple way to get possession. The unfortunate thing is you cannot claim the arrears at the same time. And as I said previously, you have to wait until the end of the fixed term. If the tenant breaches the tenancy during the fixed term, you can serve what's known as a section eight notice. Now these are normally used where the tenant falls into arrears but the tenant must be at least two months in arrears to be able to use this. Now, rent arrears is classed as a mandatory ground, so again, obtaining possession shouldn't be an issue. The difference with this procedure is there is a court hearing. So a notice is served giving 14 days for the tenant to either pay to comply with the notice, and if they don't pay, you can issue court proceedings. They have an opportunity to file a defence, and then there is a contested hearing at court where the parties attend and put forward their respective arguments. Providing the notice is valid and the judge is happy that the arrears are as set out in the notice, then as it is a mandatory ground, the judge must order possession. If you'd like to discuss either matter further, please contact me on 0113 320 5000.